Hey, what's up guys? This is Crispy710 and today I'm going to be showing you guys um, what I think is a little bit easier and a different method on how to get glitched out so you guys can um, duplicate your guys' cars. Okay, I know a lot of you guys get stuck on two main screens. One of them is the screen that's like all gray at the docks and you guys can't do like nothing about that. Um, you know, it looks like it looks over your uh, free car from the top view. And the second screen is the infinite black loading screen when you guys try taking out your interaction menu. Um, so this way it's going to be a little bit different. Okay, and stay tuned if you guys want to uh, win a $25 PlayStation Network gift card. So we're just going to start off the glitch by hopping into the mobile operation center. Okay, so now that you guys are inside of the mobile operation center, you guys want to go ahead and double join a person at least two times. This could be either a random person or a f friend in a different targeting mode session, but it just has to be at least two times that you guys double join the person. Okay, so let's go ahead and find a different person and double join them twice. So that's once, one more time. Now hop inside of your car, wait for it to turn on and head over to the criminal enterprise starter pack okay guys and you guys are going to want to go ahead and open up these three links right here it does not matter in what order you guys open them up okay it just uh, matters that you guys open them all up so that they can just like load up quickly okay and um, after you guys go ahead and load them all up you guys are going to go over here um, to like the third uh, to the third screen and right here you guys want to double join somebody either the same person or a different person in a different targeting mode session all right now it kicks you out of the car double join that same person again hop back inside of the car wait for it to turn on and go to the criminal enterprise starter pack and go back to the same exact screen okay so the third one and double join somebody again okay so we're gonna do that one more time all right we're gonna hop back inside of the car wait for it to turn on go to the criminal enterprise starter pack and you guys want to go to the exact same screen and right here we're going to click x and r2 and double join that person okay so as you guys can tell we clicked x and r2 we double we're double joining the person so click x circle and you guys should be on this gray screen okay so now just start tapping r2 and eventually it'll give you guys the option not the option it'll guys it'll kick you guys back into the regular screen and you guys can drive the uh, the the elegy back inside of your guys' uh, mobile operation center, okay? So I double joined somebody just to, you know, just to do it out of random. Uh, but yeah, as long as you guys keep uh, tapping R2, um, which is the gas um, button, you guys will end up spawning back inside of the bunker. So just make your way back over to the mobile operation center, okay? Okay, so now that we're in here, you guys want to go ahead and double join uh, either the friend or a different person in a targeting mode session twice. Hop back inside of the car, wait for it to turn on, and make your way over to the Criminal Enterprise Starter Pack. Okay, and right here, you guys want to go to this link, click X in R2, and double join somebody. Now, you guys should be able to move on this gray screen. Hop out, and you guys are going to spawn over at the docks. And immediately take out either a bazooka, an RPG, um, or a grenade launcher whatever and kill yourself okay so as soon as you guys go ahead and kill your guys' cells um the game thinks that you guys were still um in the car um but the car is nowhere to be found okay guys so if you guys need me to do this a little bit slower if you guys need me to um to go ahead and explain it like a bit simpler in a different way um then I will try my best. But as you guys can tell, it says, um, what's it called? Right here in the vehicles, it says return personal vehicle to storage. And when I go to request personal vehicle, it says that it is already nearby. But the car is nowhere nearby, okay? So you guys are already glitched out, guys. You guys don't need to go ahead and get drunk. You guys don't need to pull out your interaction menu. None of that. You guys just need to hit it to where you guys get into the gray screen. And you guys jump out. But as soon as you guys jump out and you guys land, you guys want to try and kill yourselves as soon as possible. Um, it did give me like about 10 seconds, but I have tried it previously and it... Uh, um, 
it spawns me back inside of the bunker. So as soon as you guys spawn onto uh, onto like land or whatever, you guys just want to go ahead and kill your guys' cells, okay? And um, just pay attention to who is in this session. Um, I don't have any friends in this session, and sometimes it is hard to come back to the exact same session, but um, I will be showing you guys uh, when I get over to the spot to duplicate the car that um, I am still in the same session. It is still the same people in this session, and um, yeah, guys, today it is uh, March 23rd, so this glitch is actually still working after every single update that... Um, that Rockstar has done to GTA. So yeah, guys, I hope uh, this helps you guys out a lot. So I'm gonna just go ahead and forward this until we make our way over to the um, Los Santos Customs to start duplicating our cars. Okay, guys, so we made our way right on over here to the spot um, right here by the Los Santos Customs. Um, it did take me a little bit of time to make my way over here just because I saw some tryhards in the session and I decided to go ahead and kill them. But if you guys don't believe me that I went ahead and, you know, I like had to do a few things in the session or whatever, like I can go ahead and um, put it up in a different video. Um, but anyways, guys, uh, all you guys want to go ahead and do after you guys get glitched out is just make your way on over here to the... Um, to the spot that I have told you guys. If you guys still need um, the requirements and everything for this uh, glitch, go ahead and check out the previous videos um, and you guys will be able to see or hear me tell you guys the requirements for this glitch. But the glitch is honestly very simple. It's very easy and it's super fast. Um, and it's actually pretty consistent now. Um, there's just a couple ways that you guys can hit it um, inside of the mobile operations center. Either one by getting drunk or the other one by jumping out of the car while you guys are in the gray screen. Um, but anyways, as soon as you guys make your way over here to the spot like I've been telling you guys, uh, go ahead and park the mobile operations center just like I parked it here. Um, and call up the car that you guys want to duplicate, okay? So after you guys go ahead and call it out, uh, get into the car and put it right behind the blue spot or barely touching the blue spot, okay? Uh, not the blue spot, the blue dot, all right? So we're going to go ahead and put it right behind the blue dot. Now we're going to make our way back over to the mobile operations center and we're going to click right on the D-pad um, or right on the controller to detach the trailer, okay? So now you guys want to go ahead and run to the back of the trailer and when you guys um, hop inside of the car, you guys are going to click uh spam right and x on your guys's controller okay so keep spamming right and x until you guys come to a black screen just like this now keep uh spamming um x on your guys's controller and um just keep doing it for a few seconds and eventually you guys will spawn outside of your mobile operation center um with a duplicated car okay guys so um it does take a few seconds, it could take a few minutes, it could take up to 10 minutes, um, but it will happen, okay guys? Uh, most of you guys think that it's an infinite black loading screen, but as you guys could tell right now, um, look, just like that guys, um, the car just appeared, uh, we're now on a regular screen, and um, this is a duplicated car, okay? One of the main ways you guys could tell that it's a duplicated car is because the Los Santos Customs store will not open and it says that this vehicle cannot be modified, okay guys? So all you guys want to go ahead and do um, at this point is take it to your guys' office garage and change one thing on the car, okay? Um, if you guys don't want to get dupe detected or dirty dupes or whatever the case is and you guys don't want uh, the daily sell limit, all you guys need to do is have custom license plates and put them on and then you guys can go ahead and sell them and it'll be a clean dupe uh, a clean duplicated car some people just say a clean duped car um as well as you as well as you guys could tell these are the same people that have been in the session since earlier since i was getting glitched out if you guys uh go back and look at the beginning of the video you guys will tell that those uh two people had another had like two other people in their uh group um so yeah all I'm going to go ahead and do is just, uh, you know, like I just did, drive my car inside of the office garage. And we are going to customize one thing on the car. And then after that, you guys are good to go ahead and sell it. And you guys could keep uh, duplicating cars back to back. All you guys want to go ahead and do is call up uh, Elegy or a free car. 
Um, it doesn't necessarily have to be uh, an LG, but don't drive it into your mobile operation center. But order one from uh, from online and put it in your guys' mobile operation center. And then go ahead and call out the car that you guys are going to duplicate. And do the exact same steps as I did, which is just put the car behind the mobile operation center after you guys park it. All right. And if you guys stayed this long into the video, um, in the next video that I upload, I am going to be, um, what's it called? I am going to be um, giving away a $25 PlayStation Network gift card, okay, guys? So um, for the people that stayed this long into the video, um, you guys can go ahead and comment one number down in the comment section below and then you guys will be allowed to comment one more number in the next video okay guys and that will give you guys um basically the double the chance to win the playstation network gift card okay guys and it's a 25 dollar playstation network gift card um but i will be putting up all of the requirements in the next video on how to win it but the people that did stay until this part of the video go ahead and drop uh Drop a random number from 1 to 250 down in the comments below and I will uh, keep that number for you guys, okay? And as well as, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys um, like it and I hope it helped you guys out a lot. Um, so don't forget to comment, subscribe, and turn your guys' post notifications on so that you guys can um, get the alerts for the next glitch videos, okay guys? Thank you very much and I'll see you guys in the next one.